In this video, I'll be showing you how I went about sculpting a Minecraft frog. Roll out a sheet of green polymer clay and press out nine pieces, then another three pieces in a creamy color. These 12 pieces will make up the body section. Creating a rectangular prism with the cream color and the same with two of the green pieces, keeping them close to the same length. With the remaining seven green, shape those into a slightly flattened cube. We can now place those all together and blend the two green sections. Moving on to the legs, two pieces each for the back legs and one each for the front legs. Shape the front legs into squares and the back legs into cubes. The front legs are placed slightly in and the back legs overhang by about half. I'm cutting out a square from the back legs for the body to sit into. The eyes are made up of one piece each, shaped into cubes and placed on top of the body. At this point I noticed that the top green section is a bit too thick so I cut that down to size and re-added the eyes. For the feet I rolled out a thin sheet of clay, cut out some rectangles and with a scalpel I just carefully cut away some square sections, constantly checking back with the reference image. My six year old son is sculpting along with me and he is doing a really beautiful job. I think teal and green make a beautiful colour. The back feet are a bit larger and squarer. I then carefully place them onto the bottom of the legs, adding a needle tool to the underside so it's easier for me to hold. I then add a bit of liquid clay to adhere the pieces together and brush over the surface with a small amount of baby oil on an old paintbrush. They can now go into the oven. Their settings got bumped and ended up a little burnt, but I will paint over that. It's now time to paint on the details. I am using acrylic paint and a fine detail brush. I usually make the small details out of clay, but I have damaged my forearm and can't seem to sculpt the small pieces at the moment. Keep checking back with the reference images and just paint on the details you see. Thanks for watching, let me know what you think and I will see you next time.